Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Uncle Ricky Radio Podcast Show. Glad to have you back again. Today, I'm going to do a podcast on something I think is extremely important. Your safety in your automobile this winter. Yes, I'm going to be talking about (laughs) snow tires. Let me introduce you to my little friend. There you go. This snow tire is... Oh, by the way, funny thing. For all you lucky people out there that own a phone, a cell phone, from the company Nokia, did you know Nokia makes the best winter tire, one of the best winter tires you can buy in the world, and they're called from a company called Nokian. So they just put an N in front of... in, in behind after Nokia and they call it Nokian but it is the exact same company as the people that make the cell phones now let me tell you why I'm doing a podcast on snow tires it's kind of a little weird right not so much two years ago they made it mandatory in Quebec that you had to have snow tires period it was extremely important so I think uh, beginning of November I think If uh, memory serves me correctly, you had to have your snow tires installed. This year, the province of Ontario is doing the same thing. I think they should do it all across Canada, wherever you get snow and ice. You see, we live in BC, and we live on on a mountain. We get a lot of black ice and a lot of weird weather. We'll get a lot of heavy, wet snow, which is extremely dangerous. So you get black ice, and then you'll get 6 inches or 12 inches of snow, and then it'll rain, and then it'll get freezing rain. So you got black ice, and then you get snow, and then you get a crust of ice on top. It's probably the, the worst driving you imaginable that you can ever drive through. So every year, I make it a point to, to make sure that I run winter tires on both of our cars. And it, one tire in particular that has just impressed me is the Nokians. And it has a very, very funny name. It's called the Hepakalita. Now, the way to remember this, the rep, rep will tell you, is if you, it sounds like this, have a fajita. If you can remember the phrase, have a fajita, you're on the right track. Yeah, at least that's what the rep says. So this is the Hepakalita SUV5 snow tire. And let me tell you a little bit uh, on the website of what they say. They say the Nokian Hepakalita 5 Sport Utility is a high-performance tire designed to handle winter's harshest conditions. Well-balanced grip, enhanced by our unique bear claw technology, and upgraded square stud ensures that heavy vehicles can be controlled under extreme circumstances. Now, why am I doing a podcast on winter tires? Well, did you know that if two cars are running tires... And you get in an accident in the wintertime, and you are not running winter tires, you could be charged, even if the accident isn't your fault, you could be charged at fault because you are not running the proper equipment. So there's, there's very, very good reasons to run a winter tire. Ordinary tires, when it gets down below a certain degree, like 7 degrees Celsius, the compound in ordinary, win- uh, in ordinary tires, all seasons, will get hard and their grip will diminish quite quite badly. On winter tires, their compound will stay soft, and the grip on ice and braking and acceleration and starting goes through the roof. So I had a lot of snow tires in my time, but I'm extremely impressed with these Nokian tires. Really, any Nokian winter tires that you can get on your car or truck or your SUV would be an extremely good choice. It's just a safety factor. You know what? My wife says, oh, why do we need winter tires? Well, it's not because of her driving that I don't trust. It's other people's driving. I want her to be able to get out of the way (laughs) of the other people that can't stop or can't start or coming down the road sideways at her. So it's, it's not that I don't trust her driving or my driving in the winter time. It's all about control. These tires will be able to make you stop better on ice, on snow, on all adverse conditions, and they're very, very good wet weather tires as well. And they're not that noisy. I've seen a lot of snow tires that you can hardly even hear yourself think going down the highway at 60 miles an hour. So, folks, it is the end of November, beginning of December here. In about a week and a half, we're going to 
mount these on rims. Last year we just put it on the, the ordinary rims. But we'll mount them on snow wheels and we'll put them on again. And I'll tell you, last year we had terrible snow. We had, at one point I think in my driveway I had uh, between four and six feet. It would drift, uh, but four to six feet. I would go out and shovel the driveway and an hour later uh, the driveway would drift all in again. So it was just like almost a losing battle. But we put these on the Infinity last year and it went everywhere. It was just unbelievable. Now, we have a relative that owns a and b in Canmore, Alberta, and that's ski country. And he just bought a set of Nokians and he drove up there and he's uh, seeing a lot of adverse weather. And he said he just cannot believe the amount of control that these tires give you. So I thought I would, this is important, it's for your safety. And I thought I would do a podcast to tell you my opinion about the Nokians, top notch. So, Enjoy the podcast, and I hope you're enjoying our, our other podcasts, our other product reviews, and join us on the Healthy Tech Talk Show as well. So this is Uncle Ricky for the Uncle Ricky Radio Show saying stay safe and go out and get yourself a pair of nice Nokian Hepakalita snow tires for the wintertime, wouldn't you? Stay safe. All right. Thanks, folks. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. Take care, and stay safe.